Right now, an Indianapolis mother is recovering after someone shot multiple rounds into her home on the near northwest side. Tonight, she has a conversation with our Gina Glaris about how she ran for cover to save her baby. That mother is still shaken up. The shooting happened at this home on 31st near Harding Street. She just got out of the hospital. Takes us through that scary night. So I was laying down. My baby was laying down next to me on his crib. I just started hearing gunshots. It was so quiet. I don't know where I just started hearing gunshots. The mom, who doesn't want to be identified, was in her bed on the other side of this wall. She heard more than 20 rounds go off just after midnight. And I got up and ran with my baby, and I ran and hit me four times. And I just, like, threw myself on the floor, and I couldn't get back up. This mom was hit in her arm and her side as she ran through her living room for her five-month-old baby. I was just confused, like, it happened so quick. One of the bullets was just inches away from her son's baby bouncer. Doors and walls riddled with bullet holes. She tells 13 News she knows she was not the target. The shooter was after a person staying with her and her boyfriend. She told him to leave. He was supposed to be moving out this very day. I'm going to get out of here because it happened and I just can't stay here no more. It's not safe for me or my baby, you know. Thankful she and her baby are alive. Sometimes the innocents get hit, you know, and that's not fair because it's just not fair. Now she wants whoever fired into her home held accountable. We did check in with Metro Police to see if any arrests have been made in this case. And at this hour, they say so far, no arrests. We'll keep an eye on it.